Spotify is a Swedish audio streaming and media services provider founded in 2006 by Daniel Ek. It is one of the world's largest music streaming service providers, with over 356 million monthly active users, including 158 million paying subscribers. As of March 2021, Spotify offers digital copyright restricted recorded music and podcasts, including more than 70 million songs from record labels and media companies. As a freemium service, basic features are free with advertisements and limited control, while additional features, such as offline listening and commercial free listening, are offered via paid subscriptions. Users can search for music based on artist, album, or genre, and can create, edit, and share playlists. Spotify is available in most of Europe and the Americas, Oceania and parts of Africa and Asia. By the end of 2021, Spotify is expected to operate in a total of 178 countries. The service is available on most modern devices including Windows, Mac OS, and Linux computers, iOS and Android smartphones and tablets and AI-enabled smart speakers such as Amazon Echo and Google Home. Unlike physical or download sales, which pay artists a fixed price per song or album sold, Spotify pays royalties based on the number of artist streams as a proportion of total songs streamed. It distributes approximately 70% of its total revenue to rights holders, who then pay artists based on individual agreements. According to Ben Cesaria of the New York Times, approximately 13,000 of 7 million artists on Spotify generated $50,000 or more in payments in 2020. Spotify is accused of promoting its own Swedish artists through their own curated playlists. Reducing artist discoverability and giving Spotify excessive power over artists' income. Spotify was founded in 2006 in Stockholm, Sweden, by Daniel Ek, former CTO of Stardahl, and Martin Lorentzen, co-founder of Trade Doubler. According to Ek, the company's title was initially misheard from a name shouted by Lorentzen. Later they thought out an etymology of a combination of spot and identify. In February 2009, Spotify opened public registration for the free service tier in the United Kingdom. Registration surged following the release of the mobile service, leading Spotify to halt registration for the free service in September, returning the UK to an invitation-only policy. Spotify launched in the United States in July 2011 and offered a six-month ad-supported trial period, where new users could listen to an unlimited amount of music for free. In January 2012, the free trial periods began to expire, and limited users to 10 hours of streaming each month and 5 plays per song. In March, Spotify removed all limits on the free service tier indefinitely. In April 2016, Ek and Lorentzen wrote an open letter to Swedish politicians demanding action in three areas that they claimed hindered the company's ability to recruit top talent as Spotify grows, including access to flexible housing better education in the programming and development fields, and stock options. Eck and Lorentzen wrote that to continue competing in a global economy, politicians needed to respond with new policies, or else thousands of Spotify jobs would be moved from Sweden to the United States. In late 2016, the company launched its largest campaign to date, by placing large-scale billboards in major cities around the world that humorously mocked users. Listening Habits Spotify's chief marketing officer Seth Farbman told Creativity that there has been some debate about whether big data is muting creativity in marketing, but we have turned that on its head. For us, data inspires and gives an insight into the emotion that people are expressing. In February 2017, Spotify announced a major expansion of its United States operations in Lower Manhattan, New York City, at Four World Trade Center adding approximately 1,000 new jobs and retaining 832 existing positions. The company's U.S. headquarters are located in New York City's Flatiron District. On 14 November 2018, the company announced a total of 13 new markets in the MENA region, including the creation of a new Arabic hub and several playlists, while supporting right-to-left text in their apps. In October 2015, Thinking Out Loud, by Ed Sheeran became the first song to pass 500 million streams a month later.
Spotify announced that Lean On by Major Lazer and DJ Snake featuring Mo was its most streamed song of all time with over 525 million streams worldwide. In April 2016, Rihanna overtook Justin Bieber to become the biggest artist on Spotify, with 31.3 million monthly active listeners. In May 2016, Rihanna was overtaken by Drake with 31.85 million total streams in December 2016. Drake's just under 36 million monthly listeners were overtaken by The Weeknd's 36.068 million. Later that month, Drake's song, One Dance, became the first song to hit 1 billion streams on Spotify. Upon its release in August 2017, the single, Look What You Made Me Do, 